Um, you guys see the Pantene shampoo trans commercial? I think I posted that in my Telegram. Hold on, let me try to find that. Yeah. Jesus, let me watch this. Oh my god. This is horrid. Yes, the corporations are pushing this on kids. Sawyer is Openly. an old soul. She is our uh, spunky and creative kiddo. Gross. Sawyer also happens to be a transgender girl. Nope. I remember the first time she was out in the community wearing the clothing she wanted in her hair and she kind of was herself. And that was the first day where I saw her. Ugh. Dude. I mean, I've heard a lot of people call this like, um, you know, they bring up vegan, ca you know, vegan dogs and cats and stuff like that. This is, I mean, obviously so much fucking worse. <sighs> it's, it's like physical and symbolic, you know, metaphorical mutilation. It's like just mutilation of all sorts. She has always been super gender creative and gender hair creative. has been oh, okay. a big part of her transition. Yikes. Once she told us that she identified as a girl. This person is going to be found like hanging in a closet by hair. Like that's She so immediately up. wanted to grow her hair out. It made me feel good and confident and it made my insides match my outsides. This was a kid who knew who she was from such a young age. And as a mom, you always worry about your kids being um, loved and accepted. So dude, I'm old. Dude, it's like, how about we conform to something that's rational, right? We want to be accepted, but for good things, for rational things, for const right constructive things. Um, <laughs> you know what I mean? This is just straight up Pantene Pro V pushing transgenderism on the youth culture via their corporate influence and power and hegemony. I mean, that's that's just what this is. This is just open, brazen corporate pandering of autogynephilia and autogenital mutilation, chemical castration, junk medicine, kooky, new agey, granola munching, coastal elite, rainbow flatulating, hippy dippy fucking nonsense. <laughs> but it's mainstream, like... <sighs> Always I telling Sawyer this. to never hide who she is, always be herself, never be afraid to step out and exist as the person that she is. Our family motto is everybody loves everybody no matter what path you follow. It means Why? I can be Unless they're like a straight white male who's conservative, I guess. Be who I am no matter what. It doesn't matter because everybody loves me. My advice is is just be yourself. So, like, you, you, by the way, you, you heard the lady using a term like gender creative. It's like, okay, you know, you hear stuff like that, the up-talking, a vocal fry, the pandering, like, the kind of language that you only get on, you know, on certain hashtags on Instagram or TikTok or some, or maybe previously Tumblr before they took the tranny porn off. And don't let anybody tell you who you are. Dude. This that is so dude. That's so fucked. Like real OGs remember a time before that for corporate pandering of cutting peepees.